Hello and welcome back to the Organ Loft. On Saturday the 6th of May, the coronation of King Charles III and Queen Camilla will take place in Westminster Abbey. So this video has a coronation theme. You may have recognised the introductory music as the opening of William Walton's Crown Imperial, written for the coronation of King George VI in 1937. I did sort of learn this piece, not very well, for the Golden Jubilee of Queen Elizabeth II, but I'm not up to playing it today. Only the opening section, which I played on my Johannes Opus 377 organ. However, I do want to play something festal and majestic. But what, I ask myself, my repertoire is very limited. Then I remembered back in the 1970s when I landed the job of organist at Christchurch West Didsbury, my repertoire was even more limited. So I'd often spend my time in Forsyth's music shop in Manchester search, searching through the organ music, looking for pieces that seemed relatively easy. It was here I bought this book, Two Stays Voluntaries by Modern Composers. It was this book that opened my eyes to more modern music. The notes looked the same as, say, Bach and Handel, but the harmonies were weird and sometimes quite discordant, but at least the time signatures were normal. And so I found this book very useful for both before and after services. With the coronation in mind, I have chosen to play Festal Postlude by Guy H. Eldridge which is marked Allegro by Stozo. I've decided to use Hauptwerk and the Friesack organ because I think a more powerful sounding organ is required here. By the way, when I originally downloaded this sample set, I mistakenly swapped the I and E round. Hence, I have been calling it Friesack and not Friesack. So here is a not quite perfect rendering of Festal Postlude by Guy H. Eldridge, played on the Friesack sample set. <laughs> 